I'm Mr. Kakitani with Agilent. So I will introduce the threshold voltage measurement using the IGBT. Threshold voltage is defined as a gate emitter voltage when the collector current begins to flow at the specified collector emitter voltage. It's called the VG on, on or VGTH. On the other hand, it may be defined as a gate emitter voltage when the collector current is cut off. It's called the VG off. These parameters are measured at the same measurement setup. So there are two measurement uh, definition. One is uh, apply the collector emitter voltage to the collector terminal, then sweep the gate emitter voltage to detect the collector emitter current. Another one is uh, apply to the gate to collector voltage equal. Connect the gate to collector, then sweep the gate emitter voltage. Detect the collector current. This measurement setup is realized easily and quickly by using the diffusion pipe A. So, below block diagram is a connection. I use the two SMU. One is a MC SMU, the other one is a HP SMU. MC SMU can up apply the voltage up to 30 voltage and minus the current up to 1 amp. HP SMU can output the voltage up to 200 volt and manage the current up 1 amp. So here is a test fixture. Today I have a one IGBT with TO package. I insert this device to the fixture. I already made the connection by wiring. Okay. Let's see the software side. Okay, this is a measurement setup panel. So, top one is a gate emitter voltage. I choose the direction sweep double. Double means up three, up the, up sweep and down sweep. And also I set the number of point is 101. If we want to see more precisely. So you can set this number up to 1001. So gate emitter voltage is swept from 0 to 4 and coherence is 1 mA. Below one is a collector emitter voltage. Now I set the 20 volt and compliance is 10 mA. It's important to set the compliance current to prevent the overcurrent when the device is turned on. And also, how to detect the threshold voltage? I use a marker function. So marker detects the collector current equal 250 microampere. 250 microampere is well known value for power device. It depends on the device and the device size. If we want to change this value, so you can insert this type of dial box. So number of sample is limited. I put the interpolation button. Okay, let's start the measurement. Now I can get the special voltage 3.5 at 250 microampere. Also, please see the list. So collector emitter voltage is constant and VGE is sweep from 0 to 4 voltage. This is a one measurement. So next is I want to measure the special voltage with gate emitter voltage equal uh, collector emitter voltage. Okay. I recall. Please see the measurement setup. So VC is swept from 0 to 4 voltage. It's equal to the VG is swept. Now compliance is a 10 million pair. Just everything. I start the measurement. OK, I can get the same VTH 3.5 at 250 micron pair. 
Please see the list parameter. So VGE and VCE are operated at simultaneously. So today I measure the threshold voltage with two measurement definition. One is a VCE constant, the other one is a VGE and v equal VCE. So uh, this is a very good feature of b 5 a If you want to know more detail for b 5 a please visit the www.argent.com slash find slash p1505a-b. Thank you for watching the video. See you again. Bye-bye.